In this video, we will show how you can increase speed of your game per second or per point. We have downloaded and installed Billbox 3.1.2, but if you check the updates, it says 3.1.1, and that's the version we're going to be using. We will use 3D Demo Template. Double click our character. The move nodes that are used here are not the newest one. And let's upgrade this project to new move nodes. We go to movement, get move node, rename it to left, and let's copy over the settings. Let's set our to negative seven, and we'll delete speed of Y so that gravity can affect it, and negative seven for Z. Okay, we can remove that, and connect our new move left. Okay, let's try increasing the speed. Uh, Let's do increase speed per second. So if we increase speed, let's do something like 100%. The speed will increase by 100 each second. Let's duplicate this move left node for our move right. And we'll just change X to 7. Let's run it. And we can see that speed is not changing. How we fix that is we go to the code. And in this section, we can see that if physics is not enabled, then the calculation for position, we use adjust speed x, adjust speed y, and adjust speed z to calculate that. If physics is enabled, it checks for speed. If speed is nil, it uses velocity x. And if it's not nil, then it uses speed x. And what it should be using here is our adjusted speed. So let's switch speed to adjusted speed. And do the same for move right. Find where we have speed and switch it to adjusted speed. Before we play the game, let's decrease to 10% instead of 100 and let's play. And we can see that the game is increasing speed. To show how speed increases per point, by default, let's set percentage to 100%. Go inside our script, find the place where speed point factor is being calculated and log speed factor. Quick play, show log, and let's test it. And first point we collected, we got speed factor of two. Second point we collected, we got speed factor of four. And the third, we got speed factor of eight. And the game just increased too fast. If that's not what you're looking for, and you want a slower increase in speed, what you can do is go, speed point factor being calculated, instead of multiplying, change the speed increment per point to multiply by current point and set that to speed factor. And let's see how that is different. And we can see that increments 2, 3, 4. Let's change that to 10% instead. And we can do the same for right. Replace this line. And let's do 10%. And now our game increases by 10% each point we collect. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, write in the comments below. Subscribe to our channel for more videos.